Hi guys, this is Mr. Dylan Records, and today I'm just going to show you a couple of my couple of my new books. Uh, and these are books that I've received very recently. Um, the top one is a Christmas present, so I've only had that one a um, matter of a couple of weeks. And the one below, I actually only received in the post today, so it's an incredibly new book for me, and I haven't yet started reading it. Um, but both very interesting books, as you can probably see. They're both um, on the subject of Bob Dylan, and they're both actually from the same author. And um, the author <laughs> is Clinton Halen. Um, a lot of you will know him, a lot of you won't. Clinton Halen is actually one of the leading, probably the leading, uh, Dylan biographer out there. Many consider him to be um, the only uh, Dylan biographer worth reading. So um, his books are... Um, go into great depth on the life and works of uh, of the 1960s poet Bob Dylan and uh, so I thought I'd just pick up these two books and uh, get stuck into them just to expand my knowledge on uh, on Dylan so I'll just quickly show you both of them, this is only going to be a very short video um, this one I received for Christmas and uh, this is Bob Dylan Behind the Shades Revisited and this is Halen's book, I believe published in uh, 2001, so it's been out about nine years. And um, the reason it's called Behind the Shades Revisited is because um, I believe Halen wrote this and then revised it um, about five years after he originally wrote it. Um, so this really is an account of the whole of Dylan's career from the very, very beginning. Actually, the whole of his life. This is This goes from when his very early days in Minnesota in the 1940s uh, it goes all the way up I believe to 90s so um, this book is full of information and if you want a broad knowledge on uh, on Dylan's career then I think this is definitely the book to get it's kind of the bible for Dylan fans and uh, and Halen as I say is a very well highly regarded um, biographer and uh, yeah it's a very very big book as you can see uh, I'm not a great reader, if I'm honest, so um, it's going to be a challenge for me to read read this, but uh, I'm obviously very, very enthusiastic on the subject of Bob Dylan, so uh, chances are I'll get, uh, I'll get a long way into it, uh, if not all the way through it uh, this in the coming months. Um, so I've read about 20 pages of this, and uh, so far I've really, really enjoyed it. Um, I got it for Christmas, as I said, so um, not really read much about it, but it goes into some great detail, and uh, you know, it's uh, you certainly can find out a lot of stuff that you didn't know before. So um, if you're just you're interested in Bob Dylan and uh, and his life, then you've probably been looking on the internet and uh, various web pages um, or reading maybe his book Chronicles, um, and that's all. That's all good stuff, but this goes into that, you know, that just get, this just goes the extra mile, and you get that extra information that you don't get on all the other, from all the other resources. Um, so this is definitely a book worth picking up. Um, I got it for Christmas, but I believe probably only ten, fifteen pound for this book, and you get, as I say, a lot in it. So that's the first book, and the second book we have, which I say, I say only, I only received this today. And this is Revolution in the Air, and uh, this is, I don't really know much about this yet, um, I picked it up uh, on Amazon for just a fiver, so it's uh, it's really very cheap, and uh, another thick book, uh, well relatively thick anyway, um, this book actually has I think 500 pages in it, so, um, but this is actually a very very different book to uh, Behind the Shades Revisited. Um, this being really a true biography, and this being um, a look at specifically the songs um, that Dylan has wrote throughout his career. And uh, this is actually the Songs of Bob Dylan, Volume 1, um, from 1957 to 1973. So you don't get all of Dylan's songs in this book, but obviously there's another volume, and you get the later years in that volume. So. Um, this is Revolution in the Air. You get uh, an analysis or an uh, interpretation by Halen on uh, on each song that Dylan wrote between those years. 
between the years of 57 and, and 73. Um, so it's very, it's going to be very interesting for me to read um, his interpretation on uh, on these songs and just uh, learn a bit more about the history of them or um, the the influences of uh, of the early career, um, Dylan's early career. Um, so I'm really looking forward to getting stuck into that. I'd say it's probably a book that you're going to dip in and out of um, at various times. It's not a book, well, it might be a book that you sit down and read um, all the way through, but I think I'm going to use it for kind of a, a dip in and out thing, like um, if I want to find out about the song then I can just refer to this and it'd just be a nice uh, nice way to, to learn about some of the songs. But um, yeah, two very different books. Um, but two you should definitely pick up, pick up if you're a Dylan fan. So there we have it. Um, two Clinton Halen books. Obviously, only received these um, in the in the last couple of weeks. So um, yeah, check them out if you're uh, if you're a fan of of Dylan. And uh, yeah, that's about it for this video. If you uh, want to leave a comment, if you have either of these books and uh, want to let me know what you think of them, just leave a comment below. Um, subscribe on my channel or leave a leave a comment um and yeah uh, i'll have more videos up soon all right thanks guys